Hello, my name is Jasper Ford and this is my latest book, The Constant Rabbit. Well, what is it about? I think probably the easiest way, perhaps, is to uh, read a passage from the book. Uh, here we are. The spontaneous anthropomorphic event had taken place before I was born, so rabbits talking, wearing summer dresses or driving cars never seemed that unusual to me. Their appearance in 1965 had not been reported immediately, as the whole thing was dismissed as an elaborate hoax, right up until the moment Franklin Rabbit chatted to Charles Wheeler live on the BBC's Panorama special. After that, every news station on the planet wanted to talk to the rabbits and find out how this all came about, something which still remains elusive today. The initial scepticism and disbelief then turned to curiosity, celebration and acceptance, before taking a downward spiral during the knotty issues regarding status and rights, for changing, as their numbers grew, to suspicion, condemnation, hatred and fear. So the book is set about 2021. There are 1.2 million anthropomorphised rabbits living here in the UK and the government wants to rehome them in Wales to this vast mega warren. The story is told through the eyes of Peter Knox, who lives in a little village in the very middle of England, and he works for the Rabbit Compliance Task Force, but does not consider himself leporophobic in any way. Uh, things start to get complex when a family of rabbits move in next door to Peter. Uh, is it allegorical? Uh, yes, it is. Um, is it subtle? Not really. Uh, but then we live in kind of unsubtle times. Uh, that's about the tune of it for now. The Constant Rabbit comes out on the 2nd of July and I'll be adding to this little video over the next few days.